Hello, this is Mike Panaki, owner of Network Protocol Specialist LLC. Over the last 20 years of network troubleshooting, I've found that in order to successfully analyze network traffic, I must first get the right packets in the capture buffer. In this video, I'm going to talk about a few of the features of the OptiView XG that make it my go-to tool for packet capture. The first step in capturing the right packets is to get in the path of those packets. While we can use technologies such as SPAN to accomplish this, nothing beats tapping the connection between the device being monitored and the rest of the network. The tap not only ensures we get all the packets, but that the timing is correct, which becomes critical when troubleshooting voice and video problems. Fortunately, the OptiView XG has an integrated Ethernet tap that allows me to get into the path of the packets without any additional equipment. This tap will pass full line rate, full duplex gigabit traffic, and 802.3 AF power over Ethernet. Passing PoE makes tapping voice over IP phones and wireless access points a breeze. Once I get in the path of the packets, I need to filter down on just those devices that are part of the problem. Reducing the number of packets captured reduces the time it takes to analyze the traffic. With the OptiView XG, not only can I set up filters on protocols and IP addresses, but I can use free string match filters. These filters enable me to specify a pattern and search for that pattern anywhere in the packet at full line rate. This comes in handy when capturing packets with error messages, such as SQL errors. After getting in the path and setting the filters, I set up one of the unique features of the OptiView XG, which is capture triggers. With the trigger feature on the OptiView XG, we can set up a pattern that will cause the analyzer to stop and save the capture buffer. Even better, we can set this trigger to put the trigger packet in the center of the capture buffer. This means that 50% of the buffer is pre-trigger and 50% is post-trigger. When we look at the trace file, we can see what was happening on the wire before the client even knew the problem was about to occur. When I utilize, the Save Sequences to Disk feature on the OptiView XG, each time the trigger pattern is found, the analyzer will save the buffer and start capturing again. This allows me to get multiple examples of the problem occurring, increasing the odds of isolating the problem and getting it resolved. Alone, each of these components makes getting the right packets quite easy. When combined, I can get in the right place, capture the packets required, and stop the capture when the problem happens. I would rather put the effort into analyzing the packets than into capturing them. This is one of the reasons I use the OptiView XG for packet capture and analysis. To learn more about how the OptiView XG can help you troubleshoot your network problems, please visit www.enterprise.netscout.com forward slash OptiView.